Hey guys, what's going on? Gassy back and playing some more Skyrim Dawn Guard DLC. Last time I became a vampire. Oh, there's the subtitles. I was wondering why they were not going. Uh, I'm a vampire now. I'm not going to transform just right now. But actually, I could transform right now. Should, couldn't I? Let's see, is that even assigned right now? I figured out right before I stopped recording how to transform back into normal people's. It's not going to be under shouts, it's going to be under powers. A vampire lord. Yes, all right. Let's, let's transform. Hey, blue. Ready? Why are they mad at me? What? What just happened? Why is everyone mad? I just trent. What? Why? Why are you do. Why is everyone mad at me? You guys are vampires too. You're supposed to be on my team. What is going on? Do they like take that as an act of aggression? Interesting. Okay. Ah! I don't see how many I can kill. Obviously, I'm gonna reload, but. Wow, you are a vampire and you can mess people up. Yeah! Cool! Bam! Oh shit! More vampires! What the hell is that? Oh, it's a gargoyle. Alright, I'm done with this. I really wasn't even taking much damage. I don't know what happened there. I don't know why they all freaked out on me. I just transformed into a vampire. They already know I'm a vampire. Even the guy before, last time when I was playing, he's like, You know that doesn't impress anyone around here. Okay, whatever. Don't transform into a vampire when you're in the vampire lair, apparently. Because that's a no-no. But yeah, I turned into a vampire last time. Um, I didn't realize that you also got a skill tree for werewolves with this update. Had I known that, I might have stayed a werewolf. But, you know, I figured it'd be cool anyways to see what a vampire can do. I've already kind of been a werewolf and done stuff. And the vampires seem very, very, like, I don't know, overpowered. I don't want to say overpowered, but they have a lot of cool stuff they can do. I think I was supposed to talk to this guy right here. To Garen. Eh, why am I not uncrouching? Shut up. Why am I stuck in crouch mode? This is... I don't... I don't like this. Aha! Nope, I'm still stuck in... What is this? I don't want to be crouched anymore. What's happening here? I didn't turn on toggle crouch or anything, so I mean, what the hell's going on here? Um... No... I don't know what's happening. I have never understood the Nord fascination with... Okay, I'm gonna reload again, because for some reason my crouch is messed up. I don't know why. <laughs> the thumbnail for that pic looks funny. Oh! Armor bat armored battle trolls. Interesting. I haven't encountered one of those. But yeah, I'm a vampire. And the head vampire dude, I forget his name. Which told me to talk to this Garen dude to do stuff. There we go. Can uncrouch now. Understood. Okay, shut up. Let me look at my quests. Harkin, okay, that's the name of the dude, has asked me to speak to Garen Marathi, telling him simply, it is time. Oh, how cryptic. You vampires are so secretive and, and, and mysterious. Nord fascination with weapons. Prefer these vampires as opposed so to the friggin' Twilight, pouty, shirtless, glitter doused vampires that's right i said glitter doused all right let's talk I'm sure lord harken is grateful you've returned his daughter lord harken remember your place i see now what is our lord's wish well well he wants the chalice then you've heard of the bloodstone chalice um I've never heard of it. It is a rather well kept secret. I might have, but I just don't remember hearing about it. Been in Lord Harkin's possession for quite some time now. It is, when used properly, able to increase the potency of our powers. He has neglected using it for ages. If he wants it filled now, then grander things are afoot. This is good. Okay. Follow me. 
Hey, also, um, Nick, eat my diction, if you're watching. Wow, oh, there's a bear on the wall right here. It's dead. It's a dead bear. Dead bear! Hey, look, gargoyle. Alright, I'm following him, apparently. Where are we going, dude? What's my quest say? Follow Garen. Alright, then. They're eating peoples. Excuse us. I need to fetch the bloodstone chalice. The chalice? Why? What are you up to, Garan? Lord Harkin's orders, Orpheo. Calm yourself. Our friend here has been ordered to fill the chalice. Goddamn right I have. Really? Indeed. He's off to Redwater Den. Well, then. Best of luck to you. Then Galmo okay. and Ortheolf are Harkin's primary advisors. I'm sure they're quite surprised to learn that you're taking the chalice. And here we are. Now, this chalice needs to be filled directly from the bloodspring that is the source of Redwater Den. But that's not enough. Okay. Once that's done, the blood of a powerful vampire needs to be added to it. Keep in mind that Redwater Den has fallen into... Let's just say less reputable members of society now dwell there. It's your choice whether to attempt to deal with them or force your way through. Mm hmm Hurry back. You don't want to keep Lord Harkin waiting. How come your eyes are like a yellow, but everyone else's are red? I am above the petty squabbles. Oh, because you're above the petty I squabbles. I forgot. I forgot. I really want to hit you right in your face. Where's the chalice? Did he already... Do I have it? Apparently. All right, let's do that. I am doing the bidding of vampires. Interestingly enough, I started out this quest tree by trying to go after vampires, and then they're like, "Hey, join, join the vampires. We, we you know, we, we can be, we can fly and stuff." And I was like, okay. Have I already been to the, anywhere near this area? Where's it at? Over here. Over here! I'm quite far away. Redwater Den. I guess this would be the closest. Let's do that. I'm going to try to deal with the people in Redwater Den. Talk to him with words. But if one of them says something insulting, I swear to God, I'm going to go vampire lord on their ass. Just blah! You know. And then fly around with my bat teleportation. Hmm. Spinning the sword. Also, if you hear eating sounds, I'm sorry. I haven't really eaten that much today. And I still wanted to record. So I got some snacks. I have... Sun-dried tomato and basil wheat thins with some hummus. That's like a spicy hummus. I don't know. Who's talking to me? Someone's warning me and I literally just got here. Oh, you. I kind of want to go vampire on your ass. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. Brrrr. Haha, <laughs> you didn't think I was a vampire, did you? I totally am, though. Yeah. Wow, frickin' vampires hit hard. Can I use this to, like, reanimate them or something like that? Oh, okay. Too powerful for Ray's dead. Is that a village or something after me? Oh, those are spiders and stuff. How do I... Ah! Revert form. Okay. Oh, then I hit that. Um. 
There we go. No longer vampire. Can I just keep going back and forth? Let's try it again. Oh yeah, I can. See, with vampires, you can only use it once a day. This, I can just keep going back and forth. I mean, with werewolves, you can only use it once a day. Unless they change that. They might have changed that with the update. I'm not sure. I'm kind of an ugly vampire, aren't I? Alright, let's go back. Boom. Oh no, that's the bat teleportation. I don't want to do that. Am I scaring you, Shirubok? I'm sorry. Sorry, Shirubok. Look, I can fly, Shirubok! Oh. Alright. And back we go. Okay. This way. Let me use my horse. I don't feel like walking. How far away are we? Not that far away. Alright. Keep going this way, I guess. I think there's spiders down here. Get away, spiders! Get away! I remember him saying, though, that like, I have to be careful now, because obviously Vampire doesn't like sun very much, so... I wonder what the effects are if I'm like out in the day, riding around. Shut up, bear! Off to go fill the Bloodstone Chalice! Looks like we're coming up on it. Yes. Redwater Den. Let's do this. Where are my weapons at right now? Alright, I got the two ebony maces. Left and right. Alright, cool. Where's the entrance? It's just like back here. Oh, hi! I didn't, fuck, I didn't even see that guy there. And around inside, there's a trap door that'll lead you in. I'm gonna talk to him. You here for the skooma? Nope, I'm not here for the skooma. And around inside, there's a trap door that'll lead you in. Redwater lookout. Hi. Lying. Go on in. Otherwise, shove off. I kind of want to hit you now because you're being disrespectful. But I'm not going to. <laughs> you hear Father Skuma? There's a trap door that will lead you, blah blah blah, Skyrim Nord voice. Uh huh. Hold it. If you're going downstairs, See? you keep, you your, keep your weapons to yourself, or we'll be getting bother acquainted. I said bother. And behave yourself. Oh, I'll behave myself. As long as you keep your stinking ass out of my face. That's right, you walk away. Go. Why did he open that door? Oh, is that where I'm supposed to go? I don't like those eyes you got. There's a bad hunger to them. You can't even see my eyes. I have a mask on. Don't don't be presumptuous, alright? Your skin's as pale as the snow. Scared of sunlight or something? Again, um, wearing armor, unless you're Clark Kent of, uh, you know, Tamriel, you can't- me. Shut up! 